Hi everyone, and welcome again to Nettle, the go-to place to learn about business, finance, economics, and much, much more. My name is Sava, and in this short video from the Excel 101 series, we'll investigate key functions to work with text in Excel, including left, mid, right, and find, and we'll apply them based on a simple and intuitive case. For example, you have got a selection of full names, these can be your friends or people you work with in the office, and you might need to split those into first, second, and family names based on spaces. And obviously, there is a way to do it using the data tab in Excel. We can copy them here, use data text to columns feature, select delimited, go next, and use spaces as delimiters. That would do the trick. However, a dynamic way that would adjust based on your initial input data and also teach you something about how to work with text in Excel would be to use the functions. First, we need to find the first space in each of the full names. So we'll need to find a space within our full name and we don't need to specify any start number here because that's the first space we want. For the second space, however, we'll need to find a space within the same full name text, but we need to start from the next letter beyond the first space. So here we reflect it using the F2 plus one command. And we see that the second space in this full name is in the 10th symbol, which if you quickly double check is indeed correct. And finally, we need the length of our full name in symbols, and it is indeed 18. And now these can serve as guides for our left, mid and right functions to extract the first name, the second name and the surname or the family name. The first name is on the left of the full name and it is of length first space minus one. So the first name is whatever occurs before the first space. And that's indeed does the trick. For the family name, we have to go to the right hand side of our full name text and we need to select the appropriate number of characters. And if you think about it carefully, it is just the length of the total string or the total string of text minus the place, the symbol where the second space occurs. And that retrieves the family name. For the second name, we'll have to use the mid function and specify again the original text. Where do we want to start from? And we want to start from the next symbol beyond the first space and the number of characters we need to go to capture the full second name is the second space minus the first space minus one. And that can be applied throughout our data selection and correctly identify first, second and family names of any number of people that you've got uploaded into your Excel spreadsheet. And that's how you use left, mid, right and find functions to flexibly work with text data in Excel. Thanks very much and stay tuned for more videos from the Excel 101 series.